Good morning friends, I am Dr. Prabodh, I am going to talk on HACCP. Today, in era of FSSA, HACCP has become so important because it is a preventive system for the food safety. HACCP means Hazard Analysis Critical Control Point, HACCP. Everybody knows about Hazard. What is Hazard? Hazard is a biological, physical or chemical agent which has potential to cause harm or having a food safety impact. The word potential is very important. Why it is a potential? Because it may not have proven, but it has a potential. Friends, many people actually go through the 5 days of HACCP lead auditor course, but the principles are not clear. When we talk about HACCP, hazard analysis is the most important aspect. What does it mean? You have to analyze which hazard. After that, you have to find out the CCP which is a critical control point and control the that CCP. What is CCP? CCP is critical control point if the measures are taken, if the controls are empowered on that point, the safety issues or hazard can be eliminated or reduced. HSCP was introduced first time in 1959 by Pillsbury when the food was going to NASA. 1969, first time the codex adopted the principle of HACCP. After that, 1995, the first industrial use of HACCP was used or the standard was framed. After that, many other certifications came on basis of HACCP like ISO 22000, FSSC 22000 and many more. I will give the example of day to day life. Most of us are aware about the milk spoilage. Milk you take as a commodity. If you apply the principle of HACCP, what is a hazard to the milk? Microbes. If you do not take care of that hazard, the milk is going to get spoiled. So, we know microbes are the most critical hazards for the milk. How to control? The best way is a boiling. So, the boiling becomes the CCP, critical control point. So, how our mother or sister or wife do? They boil the milk up to the point which kills all the microbes that become CCP. If you do not boil the milk up to that point, then milk may get spoiled and it will have a hazard or health issues on the consumer. So, what are the two steps are which are important? Identification of the hazard and control points, how to monitor that control points and if something goes wrong, how to correct. There are two myths about HACCP. HACCP is about food safety. It is not a quality tool to improve the quality of the product. There is a myth that I am HACCP certified organization and thus my product is best quality. No, quality may be one of the outcome of HACCP. Second thing, it is a preventive system. It cannot work as a corrective. Once the milk is spoiled, no HACCP can correct the milk, spoiled milk back to the good milk. The third HACCP system is all about a habit, a preventive tool for food safety management. So friends, I hope I could clear your doubts about HACCP and next time we will come back with some more good product. Thank you.